sure. It's a bit laggy, but you can't really ask more from a really old iPhone 7 and even older, normal, simple Samsung TV. Hey, what is going on everybody? I'm Riz. And today we've got a really requested tutorial. Today we are screen mirroring iPhone 7 or any older iPhone to a non-Android simple Samsung TV. So let's dive right into it. By the way, if you're not subscribed to the channel, be sure to subscribe because there's tons more great content coming soon. All right, so the first thing you wanna do on your iPhone is to go to the App Store and download a free app called Replica. Now, let me tell you, I've been using this app for a long, long time now and it's this is it's free and it's really easy to use i'm not getting paid or anything by the way i genuinely like this app this is probably the only app that's free and it lets you screen mirror your iphone to your tv for free you don't need to pay by the way i'll show you in a while all right so once the app is downloaded now it's time to go to the settings and now you have two options here now you can either use your mobile data for your personal hotspot or you can use wi-fi connection by the way so if you don't have a wi-fi connection just go to the mobile data and turn on the mobile data and then turn on the personal hotspot settings that way you don't need a wi-fi connection or if you don't want to if you don't want to use your mobile data you can always use Wi-Fi if you have Wi-Fi nearby. So I recommend using Wi-Fi, but if you're using mobile data, that's fine too. You can use mobile data. Be sure, uh, by the way, it's, it might cost you, so you have to be careful. All right, so now onto your TV, go to the settings and go to, by the way, this is a normal Samsung TV, not, this is not an Android TV. Just go to the network settings, go to the network settings inside the settings. And if you're doing this for the first time, go to the network settings. And now here you have to connect your TV to the Wi-Fi connection or the hotspot that we turn on from the iPhone. So in this case, I'll use Wi-Fi for an example. So there you have it. My TV is connected to the Wi-Fi and that's pretty much it. No need to do anything else. All right, so now let's fire up the Replica app on the iPhone. Now, this is for the first time uh, that, I'm, that I've installed this app on this iPhone. So just follow my instructions. You really don't need to buy it. So just click continue and just follow the instructions on screen. By the way, this is important. You have to give the permission, give the app permissions to use the devices on your network. That's really important. And then you can just disable notifications. Really, you really don't want that. Now, once you're here, you might it might prompt you to buy it. You really don't need to. If you see in the top right corner, there is an X, there is an escape, uh, there's an exit button that you have to use. Just click on it and that's pretty much it. You don't need to buy the premium. It's completely free. I've, I've been using this and I've been doing this for a long time now. So once you're done that, it's all easy now. So you will have your TVs. As you can see, I've got multiple TVs in the background. For this video, we're gonna be using the Samsung LED. So just click on your TV and it will ask you to start broadcasting. So just click on it and there you have it. I will take three seconds once you click on that start broadcast button. So you just have to be patient. By the way, if you're using an, if you're using a really old TV like me, it might ask you for a permission on your TV. So just click allow, as you can see, just click allow and there you have it. It's going to automatically mirror your iPhone or any iPhone, to be honest, to the to your TV. So that's it for me. Yes, it is a bit leggy, not going to lie, but you can't really expect anything more from a really, really old TV and a really old iPhone. So by the way, if you want to stop this, you can just always click on that red icon, red strip at the top and just click stop. And that's how you stop it. So this is it for me. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope this video helped. And uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, be sure to subscribe because there's tons more videos coming soon. All right. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.